Mindanao has always been close to my heart. In the last 25 years, I have visited various provinces and communities in this region, and every visit leads to a discovery of the rich heritage of its indigenous peoples, their intricately woven fabrics, their songs, the chants, the dances that echo the tales of their ancestors. To this day, these encounters never fail to enkindle in me a fervor of great pride in our rich cultural heritage, in a way of life that is now threatened by the demands of a rapidly changing world. It is in this commitment to preserve our priceless inheritance and to advance the interests of its stewards that we gathered leaders and representatives of the indigenous cultural communities of Mindanao for a consultation, ensuring that their voices will be heard and their interests be a priority in crafting and implementing laws that directly affect their survival as a people. The assembly in Mindanao was attended by our brothers and sisters from the Bajau, Subanon, Kalibugan, Yakan, Bukidnon, Umayamun, Manobo, Matigsalog, Higaunon, Mandaya, Bagobo, Bagobo Tagabawa, Mansaka, Dibabawon, Ata, Sama, Manguangan, Balaan, Tagakaulo, Tiboli, Arumanen, Kulamanen, and Teduray communities. Siguro, pare-pareho naman natin mapapatunayan na pagdating sa pag-aangat sa kabuhayan at pangangalaga sa ating kultura, marami pang kailangan gawin. Kulang pa rin ang akses ng mga katutubo sa medikal na serbisyo at pati na rin sa edukasyon. Kailangan pa ng higit na suporta para sa pagpapaunlad ng mga lupaing niluno at pagpapabuti ng kabuhayan ng bawat katutubo. Layunin ng ating regional assembly ito na bigyan ng pagkakataon ang mga katutubo para maiparating ang mga bagay na ito sa mga kinauukulan. Ang assembly na ito ay magsisilbing mekanismo para palakasin ang tinig ng mga leader, katutubo at ang bawat katutubo na 15 million sa Pilipinas. We came to this assembly not only to speak, but most of all, to listen. And in this peaceful dialogue among stakeholders, seeds of mutual understanding and appreciation were sown, sometimes even beyond the need for words.